Stretch number one is a calf stretch. So this is beginning stance or what we call initial stance on this leg. This is what we call terminal stance. These are the two positions that some people will avoid if you have some painful arthritis in your knee. So we're basically just recreating that position and trying to do that with the knee extended that's stretching that calf muscle out. So calf stretch would be the first stretch I would start with and I would do this every single day. Try and do this with your knee straight if possible. Stretch number two is a hamstring stretch. Get in a chair with your back supported. This is gonna be a little bit painful for some of you, but you could add the addition of pulling back on your toes. That would be the goal if you can't do both of those at the same time. That's something that you might wanna work towards versus having your foot pointed. You wanna have that foot flexed up. Pull and hold it for one minute. And then very, very important is a quadricep stretch. So you can do that in standing, better way to do this is laying down on your stomach and putting a belt around your foot. Well, the muscles on the outside of the leg over here can get pretty tight, so you're going to step across. This is the leg we're stretching. You wanna lean your hip toward that side, okay? So this is the leg we're stretching, this one, the one in the back, and lean away, okay? So those are the stretches that are super, super important, but now let's get to some of the strengthening. First one is just what we call a long arc quad. Most of you guys can do this because you sit in a chair at least once a day, so it doesn't require any equipment, but what you wanna work on is locking that knee out. Very, very important, and again, this is an exercise that you can do anywhere. Next exercise is what I call a Jane Fonda. You're just gonna do a leg lift. If that's pretty easy for you, you can add a weight, maybe even that same weight you used earlier for your stretching. And then same thing, you, got, you wanna target those hamstrings, so just a hamstring curl. And then this is a more advanced version of that terminal knee extension that we worked on earlier. You're gonna try and press that knee down and see if you can lift that heel up. And this is a pretty advanced exercise if you've had knee arthritis for a long time, but absolutely essential, especially if you're gonna have surgery. You want to be able to lock your knee out before you go into surgery if you wanna have the best chance at a full recovery after surgery. So terminal knee extension. 